Gooks. And we're actually going to see the Little Mac once again, but Asura going with the Corrin this time. Strange enough, no cloud coming from it. <clears throat> the Corrin Little Mac matchup, something uh, kind of strange to see actually. Um, you don't see it very often. Definitely going to be in Corrin's favor. Uh, Pin's such a good edge guard tool against Little Mac, not much he can really do about it at all. Uh, but Little Mac's combo game on Corrin is also very strong, so that's something else to watch out for here. Wow, the power shield right there. The defensive game right now between these two players is pretty strong. Gonna go with the neutral B to land. I actually don't don't disrespect that option in that situation. I did get him to the ground, uh, but I thought he was going to be able to armor through a pin. Finds the up there. <laughs> gonna land with the jolt haymaker. How aggressive. Goes for the jabs here. That definitely could have been a jab, jab, KO punch right there. Not going to find the two frame there, but going to find the KO punch right there and finish it. So, Goog's looking strong. <clears throat> the 25% off that down angle down smash. And is... Uh, oh, the SD. How sad. Air dodge just a little too low and was not able to get to the ledge. Unfortunate. Asura is still playing this uh, not close to the chest at all. He's... Uh, oh, gosh. The down smash. <laughs> he went for the jab locks, too. With that down air. He had the miss tech, but nothing off it. Goodness. We're trying to read that roll with the down tilt. Not going to be able to finish it. And uh, Goog's still looking strong here. Punching the pin right in the face. Right in his extended arm. Oh, but uh, we've got a little bit of a juggle here from Asura. And that might be it, actually. Yep. Man, Little Mac's a bad character. <laughs> had a solid lead there, but uh, uh, Asura had the gimp. And it's going to be 1-0 to Asura with that corn. Looking strong. And if I was Asura, I wouldn't be too shy of switching to the cloud here. But, you know, if he wants to do it with corn, one game on with corn. No disrespect. What we got on bands here? What we got? And FD. Okay, so I imagine we'll get something like a Lilat or a Town and City pick. Oh no, he's going to stay back at Smashville. Um, is Asura going to stay? Well, that's a question here. I imagine he will, as he's not said anything. So. Oh, I guess I'm bad. Yep, so I imagine we'll stay with the Corrin Little Mac matchup as we get into it here. Oh no! We got the Me Gunner. Let's go. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, space forward airs. And we'll go with it. So, me, Gunner versus Corrin. How is this going to work out? Shoutouts to Gunner uh, Martino as well. Uh, Ezreal, as you know. As you know. So, uh, me, Gunner is one of the worst characters in the game. Possibly the single worst character in the game. Maybe me, Swordsman. Um, maybe Jigglypuff being worse. <laughs> um, but... Of course, one of the most unknown characters is no one actually plays these characters. No one actually plays any of them, these, um, which we're all so sad about. <laughs> but uh, they just weren't given the love that they needed of actually getting a character design. <laughs> the only time a character that was probably not meant to be included in the game actually didn't get played at all, unlike you know, like Wii Fit Trainer and stuff. But uh, Me Gunner. Well, it's doing okay right now. They're about even in percent. But Me Gunner doesn't actually have a bad neutral game. What sucks about Me Gunner is that she can't kill, or he or she cannot kill. Um, really, no good kill options. I think there's an up throw up air that might be possible with a 50 50. But even that doesn't really kill early. Unless you get the air dodge read and maybe you get an up smash. Probably about it. 
Of course, she's got smash attacks that might do it, but no real other options that are going to find it. Forward smash with the charge. Wow, that's still not going to kill. So, so far, this is a pretty bad character. I think that charge shot would have also not killed because uh, the charge shot's still not strong. Up there, just not lasting long enough to help with the air dodge. I'm going to find the back throw here. Yo, the forward air to get him into this right position, but wasn't able to find anything, and the up air is going to seal the deal right there. So how is Asura going to keep this going? Going to find an up smash here. Still not enough. Of course, no rage. And at 100%. Finding some pins, getting some damage. And Asura doing pretty all right with the corn so far. And they're trying to get that pin in there. spacing with the fair but not gonna work out well enough and corn getting these big combos in and good jabs right there from Asura goes with the up B out of shield Asura trying to end it right there with the F smash I don't know if it would have killed might have killed with the tipper at the edge of the stage right there so maybe who knows but this one uh, not going well at all for Googs little Mac definitely looked like the stronger option even though Asura didn't even bother camping. And he's still not bothering to camp. He's just abusing a bad character for what she is. Gonna get the down throw. Trying to find some more coverage here. Oh man, we gotta grab some of uh, Gook's first damage of this stock. Oh, he's not dead yet. <laughs> not dead yet. Mikana doesn't need to have a recovery. Gets the back air out of shield. Gook's showing off. With that uh, the dash, uh, dash dance, you know, and uh, showing off that he's in this game. <laughs> no up air right there. Definitely could have been an up air follow up. I'm not sure if it would have killed quite yet. Not that uh, higher percent. Not that lower percent. And I'm gonna find the up air here though. Way up on the top of the stage. That's certainly gonna kill. And we've got 2-0 right now in a Sura's favor. Now we're gonna keep it going. Are we gonna have any changes, guys? I wouldn't be surprised if we just go back to Smashville and see Gooks pull out another garbage character. <laughs> Seems to be what he's in for today. We are gonna finish this best of five set and then we will get on with what looks like it's gonna be Asura versus Funker Monster. See if Asura can do what Spice could not. And win that Cloud and Mega Man matchup, or the Corn Mega Man matchup if he decides to opt for that. He also does have the Lucario. I consider Lucario Mega Man to be a pretty good matchup for Lucario, so maybe he'll go for that. Well, I didn't see what they were doing. Yeah, he's gonna stay. Okay. Go back. Oh, I missed by a lot. And we're in it. As we get started here, he's going to pull out the Charizard this time with my Charizard skin, no less. Oh, well, Googs will have to take that from you later. And they got dash dances and all that kind of stuff. Break my shield, please. No, it's okay. Whatever. All right, Charizard, Corrin. Who's the finer dragon? So this is a matchup that I don't think is that actually that bad for Charizard. Um, it's not a matchup where Corrin can just abuse the top tier privilege. Uh, Flamethrower does a lot of work against Corrin, especially in recovery situations, uh, because uh, Corrin's recovery is pretty linear, pretty predictable, and of course. Down throw combos are going to work very well on Corn. So far, not going too bad for Googs. The only thing that's definitely difficult here is Charizard is going to struggle to land in most situations. But we're going to get the grab here in the down throw fair. Going for a flamethrower right there. I don't like that choice. Probably if you're going to go for a read option, that he's going to land right there. 
definitely getting the re-grab forward throw is the option. Going to keep the flamethrower pressure up here on the shield. Not going to find anything. Trying to get the jump right there with the up smash. I'm not going to get it. Oh my goodness, the flare blitz. It's not enough yet, but it might be soon. Trying to get the two frame with the down smash. With the down air, excuse me. Down throw, not going to be able to find anything here. Oh, he's dead. Yep. Got bit. Snake bit. Alright, so this is where things can get kind of nasty for Charizard. Being down a stock, it's going to be really hard for him to get in and finish it. Because Corrin can kind of just play safe, do Corrin things, and rack up a ton of damage as is happening right now. Off of just a couple of neutral interactions because it's so hard for him to land. But going to find the back air off of that really whiffed, I think that was an up smash for decision. I'm going to land right here, so... Oh my gosh, another Flare Blitz. Can't roll past that, you kidding me? Charizard, you're too fat. You ain't gotta roll. <laughs> oh, so sad. So sad indeed. GG's, guys. 3 0 to Asura. And we're gonna get it with. Oh, whoops. Asura takes it, and we're gonna have Funker Monster and Asura on stream. Googs dip out.